Joining me in conversation is tennis legend Boris Becker. Boris, welcome back to India. Thank you. Well, we are talking about perfect players and perfect strokes. Who, according to you, in the current world of tennis, or is there one perfect player according to you? Well, the world rankings uh, don't lie, so uh, you have to go with that. Uh, mm -hmm. Meaning, Murray is one, uh, Novak Djokovic is second, and, and so on goes the list. Um, yeah, we talk about the perfect moment. We talk about perfection. Um, it's it's there are moments, there are brief moments of perfection, and if you win a Grand Slam, if you reach a number one ranking in the world, that's certainly perfect. Mm -hmm. But the problem is you have to do it again the next day. Boris, the way the year has unfolded with Roger Federer winning the first slam, um, were you surprised And Roger Federer and Rafael Nadal again playing uh, uh, in, in the final? Well, we shouldn't be surprised by a now 18-time Grand Slam champion to be in another Grand Slam final. Uh, we shouldn't be surprised by Nadal either. Uh, uh, he's been uh, a 14-time Grand Slam champion. But you're right, both came back from injuries. Uh, Roger didn't play for six months. Uh, Rafael didn't play for four months. I think uh, uh, both would agree that everybody, including themselves, uh, were surprised to see them in the final again. What about uh, Djokovic? Do you think he can return to the top once again? The year hasn't started on a perfect note for him. Absolutely. He's too big of a champion and uh, too strong of a player not to rediscover what, what made him strong in the first place. Uh, but it's true, he had a, a difficult start, uh, but it was only a start. I think the year is long. Would you say he's missing you? Uh, it's not about me anymore. You know, <laughs> uh, I don't think it would be fair. Uh, he's got his team. Uh, ultimately, it's about the player, not about the coach. Finally, Roger Federer has won slam number 18, and he doesn't seem to be stopping. Do you, do you think that he has a number on his mind? Uh, I think um, he's the man of the moment. Uh, you know, first time uh, he won a Grand Slam in five years. Um, uh, we shouldn't be surprised because he's won so much. But um, he's been to a, f uh, a few uh, Grand Slam finals in the meantime. But obviously, winning is, is the next step. No, he's looking good this year. Uh, I'm sure he's thinking already about the next Grand Slam. Obviously, um, there are a number of tournaments played in between. Uh, you have to perform at a certain level. Uh, but uh, he's looking good. Thank you very much.